Um, this has just come in today, this is nice and fresh and you can see the production from last week. We've got bacon on the end, beef silver sides for brazala, necks, legs and he has a whole leg with the bone still in which will become like a big prosciutto and these are the deboned legs which we saw Carolas so doing. how long has this meat, it looks a bit darker, how long has uh, it Two weeks, three weeks, two weeks, uh, ten days, seven days, seven days. And this one just so came in yesterday? This is literally, So you yeah. can see the curing process is already happening? Yeah, the meat will start to go darker. We do put a bit of red wine on the, on the um, beef and the, and the neck, so you've also got a red wine flavor coming through in the color. Um, and you, you can also see there's um, moisture coming out of the meat into the, into the um, crates. Um, as the salt penetrates into the meat, so the moisture comes out. How long does it stay in this room for? Um, it, it depends on the thickness of the meat. That's very important. So a belly like this would be seven days in the salt, mm -hmm. whereas a leg like that would take four weeks. Okay. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And that's okay. so. This is basically the curing process, yes. which is getting the the salts into the product. Okay. Uh, it's not the drying. Then we move into the drying room, and then we have the drying process. Okay. And this is the drying room. Uh, here you can see some of the legs of ham that have been hanging for several months. Um, this one here is from uh, September last year and will be ready maybe by July, August 2011. Wow. So it takes about a year of curing. About a year? Yeah. yeah. So that's really a labor of love. It's a labor of time, yeah, absolutely, and patience. And, um, you know, the, the flavor develops slowly over time, and obviously you need to have the moisture coming right out of the product. Um, that's um, obviously, you know, the smaller the piece of, of muscle, like a, a belly here, that will be ready in about six weeks. So that will dry out in about six weeks. Um, these are the deboned legs, which take about four months. Um, and then we have a whole range of different salamis. Okay, so can you show us um, what are the different salamis? Yeah, absolutely. This is salami made with red wine. Um, we've just done a couple of trials with some hazelnut. Hazelnut. So that's wow. a salami with hazelnuts. We've got a nice fiery Italian spicy salami over here. Um, and then this is just a batch of plain, plain Italian style salami. And then we've got Stephen's fantastic range of very special products. Uh, this has got um, cinnamon and ginger, it's the Alsace. This is a saucisson sec, French style salami. This is a hot Italian, nice and spicy. We've got yeah, chorizo. Um, this one is a Toulouse, which has got nutmeg um, and then this is just a, also a plain Italian style um, little salami.